What is up, YouTube? Clickwood here, back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team video. And guys, it is Thanksgiving week, which means that there is going to be some awesome content dropped into this game. The Thanksgiving Day promos have traditionally been very, very big for Madden, as I understand it. As you guys are, if you're new to the channel, you probably aren't aware that I've actually only been playing Madden for, well, the Ultimate Team for only, what, since about February of this year. So I actually did not see the Thanksgiving Day promo last year. However, because I'm friends with guys like Chase Plays Madden and Ryan and iJoshify and London and all those guys, I have seen all of their videos that they made about the Thanksgiving Day promo from years past, uh, both Madden 13 and also from um, Madden 25. So I am fairly familiar with what they do on Thanksgiving with you know all the different collections and things like that but if you guys are unaware typically what they do is they have some you know crazy wide like you have to collect a ton of stuff to actually finish these collections but when you finish them you get some epic stuff and this year what they have is another cornucopia pack so you know cornucopia the traditional thanksgiving weird like I don't know, it's basically shaped like a bugle, if you guys have ever eaten bugles. Um, but uh, that's that's kind of what a cornucopia is in real life. But in the game, what it is is that you are going to actually get some epic stuff in your car, or in your pack. So you you uh, finish this collection, which basically contains, um, let's see here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look it up here so that we can uh, just verify. So the first thing that you've got here, uh, let's see here, the, yeah, the ultimate feast. So... Um, this is the this is the one that gets you the cornucopia pack. So basically, in the packs right now, there's going to be these things that are called uh, turkeys and or turkey collectibles as as they're called, and you have to collect a hundred of them to get this pack. Okay. Now I know that sounds like an insane amount, and really it is going to be a lot. It's going to be very difficult for people to complete this, but I have seen people completing it, so it's not impossible to do. It's not like the JJ Watt where there's probably only going to be, you know, the most feared JJ Watt where there is only going to be a few people in the entire community that were able to do it. But with this, I think that more people are going to be able to do it. And I've already seen some people, you know, tweeting them at EA and re EA retweeting them and things like that. But uh, basically what you get in this corner copia pack is 12 gold or better players including one thanksgiving day legend so there's actually a whole ton of awesome thanksgiving day legends as well so uh you know there's guys like barry sanders and Dion sanders and troy aikman and i um, trying to think of who else there is but you know a bunch of guys in there that you can get i think amon green might have one if i remember correctly but yeah a whole bunch of different players though that have awesome items for this year's cornucopia pack and the set is actually going to expire on december 12th which you know gives you some time even after thanksgiving to actually complete this if you want to but i did also want to talk to you guys a little bit about the uh the turkey day collection and basically what this is is a, is a way to guarantee yourself an elite player so what you have to do is you have to do each of the solo challenges over the uh over the next few days and once you do that, you are going to actually be able to get an elite item. So, you know, the first one here, I'm going to show you guys. I actually finished uh, the first solo challenge. And if you guys are unaware, let me uh, take a look here at the solo challenges. So you can kind of see what they're doing right now. Uh, they, they have four of them that they're listing. So basically what you have here is you're going to play against, uh, I think there's actually going to be six of them. Um, excuse me. So all of the teams that are playing on Thanksgiving. So it's, um, you know, the Cowboys, the Bears, um, the Lions. Oh, who the hell are the Lions playing? I'm trying to remember. I'm blanking out right now. Uh, whoever the hell the Lions are playing, I completely forgot right now. But then the Seahawks and the 49ers as well. So all of those teams you will end up playing against in these solo challenges. And when you complete them, you get a 1,000 coins. And then you also get what's called a turkey pack. So what I'm going to do for you guys now is open up my turkey pack that I got for finishing that first solo challenge. And we'll see what's in involved in these turkey packs. See if there's anything in them of much value. Um, I'm really not sure. I haven't seen what other people are getting in these. So hopefully there's something decent in them. All right, so there's one of the turkeys. Thir Thanksgiving turkey. We get uh, Thanksgiving dinner wing number two. And then an extras cornbread. So uh, there's all kinds of different collections that are going on right now. I showed you the cornucopia one. And that's, uh, you know, you can throw one of these into that. Uh, Thanksgiving dinner will also go into another set. Uh, this goes into the turkey dinner set. So I'm just going to go ahead and add that in there right away. 
Now the Thanksgiving turkey one can go into all kinds of different ones. And that's like I said, there's there's a, gonna be a, a bunch of ways to get these different uh, Thanksgiving turkeys. And you can put them in all these different sets and you can kind of decide like the most feared, you know, if you really wanna go all out and try and get the all 100 turkeys to try and get that uh, full, uh, the, the guaranteed uh, Thanksgiving Day elite player. But uh, if you don't wanna do that, and then also the, of course, the cornucopia. Um, you know, there's all kinds of different ones that you can do here that have different rewards for them. And you just need to choose which one you think that you're going to do. So if you're somebody that doesn't spend a lot of money on the game, I'm going to guess that you're probably going to just want to uh, send it to uh, either. You can either decide if you want to put this into the one to get yourself the guaranteed elite player, which is, you know, you only have to collect five of these. Or if you're somebody that spends a lot of money in the game, or if you're somebody that is going to open up a ton of packs, I would probably maybe try and go for the cornucopia. It's up to you, though. You know, do your do your due diligence on what you're going to actually be able to realistically complete. Because if you only get like 70 turkeys and you put them all in the set and you don't get to that 100, you're going to be kind of pissed off. So make sure that you decide what you're going to do before you start sending these to your sets. So with that being said, guys, just wanted to and I'm going to leave mine out of sets right now because I haven't quite decided what I want to do. So I'm going to leave my Thanksgiving turkeys out and, you know, like, like I said, I'm not exactly for certain what I want to do yet. But I do want to show you guys if I can. Um, I want to hop in here and look at the auctions and trades for the brand new Deion Sanders and Barry Sanders items because, yeah, these items are sick. Seriously. I know that they're going to probably put out an Ultimate Legend or, you know, whatever the hell they're going to call it. Uh, for these different uh, Barry Sanders and Deion Sanders items, but traditionally these have been some of the best cards in the game As you're gonna see here the Deion Sanders look at this thing first of all That's some beautiful play art right there. I love Deion Sanders and the Cowboy stuff as you guys can see here I'm a big Cowboys fan Happy to see my team win this past week. Uh, it was a close one But we're, we're very happy to get that win over the Giants, but look at this uh, epic Deion Sanders his attributes 97 speed 98 acceleration, 93 awareness, 90 catching. He basically has every single thing that you would want. 95 jumping, 99 kick return. So he's the best kick returner in the game, guys. Absolutely sick with 97 elusiveness. And uh, look at all those juke moves, the spin move. Everything is just ridiculous for him. Once he gets the ball in his hands, he's going to be as good as any running back in the game pretty much. Other than the trucking attribute and, and probably carrying as well, I'm going to imagine. I didn't even look at that. Let's see here trying to remember where carrying even is yeah there it is 67 so not very good on Deion Sanders for that so you want to be careful not to get hit too hard but he is absolutely ridiculous with the ball in his hand look at these coverage attributes though 96 play recognition 99 man coverage 97 zone and I mean those those absolutely rival the Richard Sherman absolutely you know, in every in every attribute, I, I think you really couldn't make a case. I would actually say Deion Sanders is better because he's faster. So I think that, in my opinion, this is the new best cornerback in the game. Now, obviously, the main problem with Deion Sanders, as it always has been, is that he cannot tackle. So, you know, that makes things pretty tough on you if you're trying to... Uh, if you're trying to uh, stop a guy in the run game or make a tackle on a guy who ends up getting a catch on him. Uh, the other item here that they're added, uh, that they've added that people are going to be super excited about, Barry Sanders. Of course, we remember the Thanksgiving Day Barry Sanders from last year. That was one of the best items in the game for the vast majority of Madden before they ended up putting out the full legend item and then the ultimate legend of Barry Sanders. But check out these attributes here. Very, very nice. 95 speed, 97 acceleration, 95 carrying. He can really do it all. The elusiveness and the ball carrier vision, all that stuff. And, of course, the spin move and the juke move with Barry Sanders. As you'd imagine, one of the absolute best in the game at all of those attributes. So there really isn't a whole lot to dislike about Barry Sanders. Uh, the only thing that I'm, you know, not super excited about with him. Uh, let's see here if I can find it. There it is. His trucking, 82. That's not spectacular. It's not terrible either. But it, then again, when you're using Barry Sanders, you don't really... You, you you love using him because he's so elusive and he can run the ball left and right and, you know, juke guys out and things like that. Most people aren't lowering the shoulder with Barry Sanders and expecting him to run guys over. So I'm not too worried about that, but it is worth noting that he's not so great in that area. Whereas his ultimate legend last year was pretty much like 99s across the board. And I expect, like I said, that they're going to eventually put something like that out for Barry Sanders as well. But anyways, guys, that is going to wrap up today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to hit that like 
like button. And also, let me know what you guys are getting in your turkey packs. If you get anything awesome, uh, please let me know in the comment section below. If you've done a cornucopia pack already, let me know that as well because I'm really interested to know what people are getting. I obviously have seen some people that are on the auction block getting these Deion Sanders and these Barry Sanders and things like that. But I want to see what you guys are getting because I know these items are going to be awesome out of this cornucopia pack. You're getting like some of the most rare stuff that they've put out in the game so far. Not only do you get the, the Thanksgiving Day Elite, but you also are going to get stuff like, you know, Team of the Week stuff or most feared items that are, you know, maybe not in packs anymore. So that's pretty damn cool. I, I definitely am excited to see what other people are getting. I really don't know if I'm going to have the time and the money and the energy to want to sit and do enough solo challenges and, and uh, grind enough to get enough coins to be able to actually open up a cornucopia pack. But we'll see. If somehow I'm able to come across it, I will absolutely upload it to this channel. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below of this whole promo as well. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to press the subscribe button because that's how you'll know when I put out a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate it. And I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.